Tonight, we're learning more about an Onslow County man charged with murdering his fiance and her son. News Channel 12 star Connor is live in Richlands, where investigators just wrapped up the scene. Star, what's the latest? Sheriff Chris Thomas says that a mother and her son have lost their lives in what appears to be an act of domestic violence. I spoke to the father of the 14 year old boy who says he's devastated. I wasn't expecting news like this around by eight, between eight thirty and nine in the morning. It's, um, it's, you know, my baby boy. That's my baby boy. Heartbroken is an understatement. Dexter White says he learned his youngest son and the teen's mother were killed early Friday. Investigators arrested 31 year old Christopher Paul Cornegay Jr. Deputies received a 911 call around 1 35 in the morning. When they arrived at the home off of Outago Trail, they found Cornegay standing in the road and found 40 year old Audrey Rose White and her 14 year old son, Audrey White, dead inside of the home from apparent gunshot wounds. White, who lives in Georgia, says he was making plans to move to Richlands to be closer to his son. This one, right? One of the hardest conversation I've ever had because I never thought I would be having this conversation. White says his son loved video games and wanted to study dinosaurs and science when he went to college. He says they were planning another fishing trip before his son was killed. Um, we like to go fishing. We were already talking about planning our fishing trip. Um, we wanted to go back to Panama. Sheriff Thomas says Cornegay and Audrey Rose Wright were engaged. He says they were called to this house multiple times in the past. Uh, it, it, it appears to be domestic related. Uh, there is a history of domestic calls at that address. Uh, but as I said, it is still ongoing, even though we do have the suspect charged with two open counts of murder. White says his son did tell him that his mother and Cornegay would argue. No, he never called me, but he had told me that they argued. Sheriff Thomas says Cornegay has his first appearance in court on Monday. Now, White says that his ex-wife's family is not in America. He says he plans on making funeral arrangements not only for his son, but also the mother of his child. Sheriff Thomas says he wants to send out the reminder that there are resources for those experiencing abusive relationships. In Onslow County, I'm Star Connor for News Channel 12.